We are glad to inform Kenyans that the Judicial Service Commission, after conducting interviews for the officers of the Chief Justice and Deputy Chief Justice, has reached a decision. As we told Kenyans previously, we were looking for candidates who will lead by example the judiciary as a third arm of government, who are persons of great depth of legal and constitutional learning, whose integrity is both impeccable and beyond reproach, who have a record of independence, who can't be influenced or pressurized politically or by economic considerations, who can provide leadership to the courts, who have shown passion and zeal to help Kenyans realize the dream in the new constitution, especially its values of equality, justice, fundamental <coughs> rights and freedoms, and a commitment to the rule of the law. In this stage, in our political and legal evolution, ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of the Judicial Service Commission, I have the privilege and the honor and having in mind the historic and momentous occasion this event herald, hereby inform you that, number one, Dr. Willie Munyoki Mutunga is hereby nominated by the Judicial Service Commission as Chief Justice of the Republic of Kenya. Two, Ms. Nancy Makoha Barasa is hereby nominated by the Judicial Service Commission as the Deputy Chief Justice of the Republic of Kenya. Dr. Mtunga has an LLB, LLM, and a PhD in law. He's a former law school lecturer, a former chairman of the Law Society of Kenya, and a renowned reformer in the political struggle of our country. He has also practiced law for over three decades. Ms. Barasa has an LLB and LLM, LLM and is presently a PhD student. She's the vice chairperson of the Kenya Law Reform Commission and a former chair of FIDA. She is an advocate of the High Court of Kenya and uh, practiced and has practiced law for over three decades. In these two candidates, the Judicial Service Commission has seen the attributes and the vision we were looking for when we started the interview process. They are a man and a woman we can trust the judiciary with. We wish them the best in their historic and onerous task to reform the judiciary and help take justice closer to the people of Kenya. This afternoon, this is this historic day, we have Judicial Service Commission. We as the Judicial Service Commission are forwarding the names of the nominees to His Excellency the President and the Right Honorable Prime Minister for further processing in accordance with the Constitution. Professor Christine Mango, Acting Chairperson, Judicial Service Commission. Thank you, members of the press.